it's not just Valentine's Day this weekend, it's also the start of sturgeon spearing. That's right, and this morning we're live at Payne's Point in the Nina area to talk about expectations for this season. Joining us live is Dale Frank. He's a member of Payne's Point Fishing Club. Hi, Dale. Thanks for joining us. Hi, Dale. Morning, Pete. Morning, Rachel. Tell us, Dale, uh, about the specifics. When does it start on Saturday? What time? Well, the sturgeon season opens at 6.30 in the morning and runs till 12.30. So what are the types of things that you, you get ready at this point and uh, up to Saturday morning? Well, right now people are getting their shanties ready, and uh, we've got several different kinds of spears that people use. This one happens to be mine, and it's a, a fixed barbed spear. They're very sharp and very effective. We have another kind of spear that has a flying barb on it, and uh, they're very effective as well. And uh, of course, then for the ladies, our treasurer, Stacy Franks, has to have a, a pink spear. <laughs> Absolutely. And, uh, with, with, with jewelry on it, you know. Nice. Yeah. Are they, are, do people around here make these spears? Where do you get them from? These are all homemade all homemade spears and uh, some people do it as a business but there's no there's no catalog that you can order a spear from so they're people are pretty uh, innovative and uh, and make several different kinds Dale how long have you been um, spearing and have you had any luck oh yeah I've had some luck uh, I've been spearing for oh probably 35 40 years what's and, your biggest uh, catch we don't catch them, Rachel. We spear I mean, spear them. <laughs> <laughs> 63 pounds. 63 pounds? S 63, yeah. When was that? Oh, several years ago. Uh, what's the, um, uh, what's the uh, whole feeling there at this time of year? I guess I'm asking, why do you go back year yeah, after year? Yeah, why do you year, do it? Dale? Yeah. Oh, it's just... It's like people getting ready for the deer opener, and, and that's what we're doing now. And it's a bigger thrill spearing a sturgeon than it is shooting a deer. It's, un, until you've done it, uh, you don't know what the experience is like. Is it because of the waiting? You know, you put so much time and effort into it? Oh, yeah. You know, people work very hard at it, and, and plowing roads and, and cutting holes and uh, getting all their equipment ready. And uh, we talk about it in June. And that's part of, and that's part of it. I'm assuming the camaraderie and stuff that you you get there in sturgeon spearing too, right? Oh, sure. There's a lot of people that you only see this time of year. You don't see them the rest of the year, and sturgeon season comes around, and they're, and they're all out here. And you're going to be at Payne's Point this weekend, is that right? Oh yeah, we'll be here. We have our annual fishery and fundraiser this weekend, and uh, with uh, live bands and food and uh, a lot of a lot of good camaraderie and. Uh, old friends meeting other old friends it sounds like a great time uh, Dale thanks sure so much is. we'll check back with you and we want to let people know that information um, about anything that to do with sturgeon sparing is on the DNR's website we're going to put a link on our website fox11online.com click on good day Wisconsin